Hey there, I'm Naepta, and welcome back to the 50th episode of our Pokemon Arceus Nuzlocke. Uh, we are about to go find out what's going on up there. Uh, but before we do that, I want to double check one little thing here. Because I realized we never actually checked to make sure these guys did have different areas. Uh, so before we use them this time... Wayward Cave, excellent. And Wayward Wood, perfect. Okay. So these are both valid team members. I do need to get rid of the unknown at some point, but for now, everyone's usable on the team except for, for a little letter L here. I'm excited. Let's go ahead and while we're in here, make some more Pokeballs and see if we can make some more potions. I don't think we can, because last time we were lacking in berries and we still are lacking in orange berries. Let's go ahead and I guess let's see if we can't Maybe catch one or two more Pokemon in here just for the experience. Ooh, actually, that's a berry tree. Ivan, can you go get berries from over there for me? Orange berry, perfect. Okay, now we can make a few more potions. By a few, I mean three, which I will totally take. And we need pep up plants in order to make super potions. Okay. So we just need to keep an eye out for all the medicinal things. Let's see if we can't maybe sneak up and catch a couple more Pokemon. Um, nice little Stantler there. That didn't quite get the back strike, but I'll take it. Hey, okay, nice. Leveling up our Pokemon. I wonder actually if we can potentially no, Zoe cannot evolve yet. Nobody can evolve yet. That's okay. We'll get there. Let's see if we can't... Backstrike! Excellent. We're just getting Zoe all the levels. Ooh, and... Haha, we can evolve Greg now. Excellent. Do it. Always exciting when you get to evolve into Pokemon. And we haven't even had Greg that long. Let's go, Greg. Behold the power. We now have a good bite. And... Let's go ahead and see if we can't catch a few more Pokemon on our way. This is exciting. We're going to have a team that can actually do things. How did nobody notice us? I don't know, but I'm not going to be uh, upset about it. Bonk. Nope, okay. Whoop. Oh, and it sees me. Okay, we're just going to take off now. Alright, oh, that's, that's a moth one and a half. We have now attracted the attention of the Alpha Malcolm. Not the desired course of action at all. Nope, still sees us. Okay. I think our best strat here... is going to be... to... run all the way over here. And... That actually worked. Nobody cares about us right now. How exciting. What level is that, uh, go bat? 37. Nope, we don't want to mess with that. Okay, good to know. Let's see if we can't backstrike this pair. So oh, you turned around. I liked it better when you were facing away from me. Fine. I will throw a Pokeball at you anyways. Get in the ball. Stay in the ball. Nope. Okay. Because I'd really like to get another level or two, um, especially for Zoe. And I think, honestly, if we catch another one or two Pokemon, we would get that level. Oh, you're, you are coming really close there, buddy. You're not interested in me anymore.
I really want to catch that Alpha Mothum, but I'm pretty sure this said Wayward Wood, like, just a second ago. So. Cool. Yes. Look at all those levels! Ooh, the backstrike on the Golbat. Uh, yes, please. I will totally take that. Stay in the ball. Nope. Okay. And he's just not phased about it? So we're gonna try that one more time. Oh. Now he sees me. Okay. We're just gonna go ahead and trigger the cutscene. Hey! How you doing, folks? I'm not running away from anything. What's the big idea of putting back all the torches I spent ages tidying away? Do you get some sort of amusement stomping around and ruining people's noble deeds? Oh, rendering a cave impassable to people who venture inside hardly seems noble to me. Hm. Well, that just goes to show that even we wardens don't always see eye to eye. I extinguish those lights for the sake of the Pokemon in the cave who prefer the dark. But now you lads have put my efforts to waste. If you think I'll just let you saunter ahead to meet Lord Electrode, you're sorely mistaken. The only way you're getting past me is if you defeat my partner, Pokemon. How will you proceed, Napta? I don't want to fight. Are you certain? It seems this is our only track forward. I don't want to fight. Please don't make me. Fine. I guess I have to. Ghost, Gunk Tank. Show these louds the true meaning of silent but deadly. <laughs> okay then. Ivan. 27 versus 40. Poison jab. And there went Ivan. <sighs> um. Carrot cake is the only thing of a level that. Alex is psychic type. Um. Oh, is it? It's no effect because he's stark and poison. Yeah, this is a problem. Um. I mean, we got bulldoze on Greg, but I really don't want to lose Greg. We're gonna send Carrot Cake out because literally the only level high enough to deal with this thing. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and fight with a Agile Aerial Ace. And we'll fight with actually an Agile Slash, maybe. See which one does more. Eh, about, about the same. Cake. Items. Um, please tell me we have super potion. Hyper potion, yes. Use. Poor little carrot cake. Okay. No, not the burn. Um. We didn't take burn damage at the end of a turn. Have they changed how burn works in this game? No, we take it at the beginning of a turn. Well then. This is a problem and a half. Um, send out Greg and bulldoze it, I guess. Um, we're just gonna... I think we're gonna strong style bulldoze it because if we don't kill it, we're we're toast. Okay, we defeated Skunk Tank. Oh, there was only one poke. We lost Carrot Cake for nothing. No, Carrot Cake. Listen here. Neither I nor Skunk Tank admit defeat just yet. Our challenge to you still stands. However, I will withdraw to afford Skunk Tank time to recover. There's no shame in tactical retreat. It's more of an advance if you think about it. Keep your guard up, we'll be back. Well, 
What a lively character. I cannot fathom Warden Melly's intention, but for now, let us press on. Um, well, the good is that we should be able to get more Pokemon. Ancient Quarry. Um, ooh, more Pokemon, yes. Alright, then tell me all about the Ancient Quarry, and then I will go catch a Bronzor, and then we will go swap out our team. This is the Ancient Quarry. The stones used to build this temple atop this mountain were all cut from this place. Whether by humans or and Pokemon working as one, or by the labor of Pokemon alone, I cannot say. The stones that were left behind should serve to cover us from the gazes of wild Pokemon. Ah, there you are, Indigo. Oh, hey, Volo, please don't battle me. Volo, was it? What is the matter, sir? I wanted to ask about that memory loss of yours. Have you considered it could somehow be caused by the space-time rift? I have no cause to think the rift is to blame, but then again I hardly remember a thing, so it's difficult to say with certainty. I can't remember my own home, nor my family, if I had any. So you might do better to propose your questions to Naepta, if, I think, if it's to do with that rift. Indeed, well... I do hope your memories return, Warden Ingo. How about you then, Epta? Do you remember what you saw before you fell out of the rift? Was there anything inside? Maybe something. I saw Arceus! Interesting. You see, personally, I suspect that whatever is on the other side of that rift is causing the strange lightning that plagues us. That makes sense. Indeed. I did some digging and found records indicating that this same space-time rift also appeared in Hisui in the distant past. That's why we already had a name for it, as it appeared, in fact. Now, what kind of world do you suppose stretches out on the other side of the rift? My guess is that it's Almighty Sinnoh's realm. But then, that begs the question, why has the space-time rift reopened when it closed once so long ago? And why would Naepta have fallen through it to us? There's just so much we don't know. I fervently hope you unravel this mystery, Volo. I'm sure it would ease people's fears over the frenzies of our nobles. And while you investigate, sir, I'll continue to prioritize the safety of the people living in this world. Oh, I am a mere admirer of the ruins in Littlemore. If something needs investigating, then I would entrust that task to Naepta. Until next time, then. Okay. Let's hopefully, uh, get ourselves a bronze ore. Alright. Pick up some iron. Oh, you see me. That's a problem. Ouch! You're attacking me through a stone block? How dare you! Stop being interested in me. Okay. Let's just wait here until the black edge border fades away. So I'm not, you know, liable to fall unconscious. There's a bronze ore. Um, so I think what I might need to do is maybe I need to feed them to get them to come closer while distracted. That was a fail and a half. Can I pick that back up? Of course not. Let's just turn around. Turn your back to me. You don't see anything.
Okay, we got a bronze ore. Um, so now we're going to get ourselves out of this cave. And doesn't mean we'll have to make the entire journey back up here, but I think that's probably fine. Go ahead and leave the quarry so that we can uh, travel back down to the Highlands camp. Get our Pokemon situation sorted out, and then we will proceed onwards. Okay. I want to see my Pokemon, please. Because I have to put Carrot Cake away. Okay, let's double check and see if there's anything else we can bring with us beyond the Bronzer. Alright, Obsidian Fieldlands. Heavenward Lookout, but we've already had a Shinx. Obsidian Fieldlands. Heavenward Lookout. Heavenward Lookout. Wayward Wood. Wayward Wood, Parasect, Ancient Quarry. Okay, so we do get the Bronze Ore. Um, and we have to name our Bronze Ore. And we have to put... Oh, we lost Ivan as well. Ugh. Alright. We were doing so good. If we hadn't lost these two to that numbskull of a warden, we'd have a full team. I'm sorry, Carrot Cake. You did good, bud. I'm sorry, Ivan. You you didn't even have a chance, buddy. Okay. So we need to name our bronze ore real quick. Um, and this is going to be um, Brian. Brian the bronze ore. There we go. So we now have our team again again. And go ahead and have Alex harvest from this tree for us. Sneaking along. Get the back strike maybe? Oh, that was trouble. Oh, wow, that, that Pokemon is farther out than I thought. What are you doing over there? You're, like, jumping. Nope. Okay, didn't get it. That's okay, we're just gonna run away. Because we're very good at running away. Ooh, we want that. You're kind of curious, but you didn't quite see us, so this is fine. We'll get that nice little catch in the Pokeball, maybe. Stay in the ball. Yes, okay. Get some more experience for Zoe. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Excellent. Oops. Seriously? Nope, okay. We're out of here. we run. Okay. <laughs> Progress, sort of, I guess. We're gonna have our Pokemon pick up, like, all the stuff in this cave, because they get experience, I believe. Nope, that was no experience. I was hoping they was gonna get experience if we had them pick up stuff. It's still very dark in this cave, so I don't think Pokemon mind the torches that much.
Let's go ahead and we'll let Greg pick up some stuff. Because I think we might want um, Greg to gain some more levels. Um, given that we had that skunk tank. And she's resting up her skunk tank. And right now I believe Greg has the only super effective move against the thing. Nope. Nope, okay. That was a fail and a half, but that's okay. We're just gonna run away. We're good at running away. Really, really good at it. That's a sad sentence. Okay. Go ahead and see if we can't catch a few more Pokemon, get some more experience. That's that. We actually caught it? Cool. Uh, let's go ahead and see if we can't catch another hair across. Turn away from me. Look away. Look away. Look away. And whatever. Oh, he sees me now. Okay. That was fun. Time to run away. Oh, we caught a gold up. So that was fun. And Zoe can evolve now. She worked, I'm surprised, but pleasantly. And we can evolve Zoe. Which is excellent news as well. Let's go ahead and have Greg harvest from the tree. Good job, Greg. And then... I guess we will take a nice little swim across the river here. Nope, okay, that did not quite work to plan. Please stop following me. Please stop following me. Oh, that was a parasite. Okay, this is, this is so not cool, guys. I wasn't trying to do you any harm. No, okay. We're going back over here. Okay, wasn't fast enough. Oh. Okay, that actually works somehow? What level is that Parasect? 36. I'm really sad that we lost Carrot Cake. We really needed Carrot Cake's levels. Got the back strike. Nope, okay, that didn't quite go to plan. We caught another Pokemon, that's exciting. Right in the forehead. Alright, he kind of is curious, but he doesn't quite understand. 
All right. Um, I think we're gonna go ahead and hop on over this way. Oh, okay. So the Paris sees me. And I think because the Paris sees me, uh, the parent's gonna see me too. Still sees me. Stop it! Why does everyone want to get me so badly? I'm just trying to go for a stroll here, people. That is not what I was asking you to pick up, right? Oh, sure. Here, where I'm standing in the plain sight of everyone, nobody sees me. A space time distortion seems to be forming. Where? Mm, nowhere that I can see. Okay, good to know. Let's go ahead and... Actually, what level is this Paris? Why can't I not tell? It's so close. Like, the little bars will, like, start to form. Can I get any closer without it being noticed me? noticing me? No. All right, let's just try and catch it then. Oh, I wanted the back strike. Okay, level 20. I could have actually battled that. Because I think we get more experience if we battle a thing. Level 37. Back strike. Stay in the ball. Cool. Oh, yes, let's go ahead and evolve Zoe. Do it. All right, well, at least we'll have, you know, the stat boost from being evolved. Goodbye, little. And we got the idea for a new move. Okay. Um, we should check some of these moves on different Pokemon. Cross Poison, yes. You definitely want that. Over Gust, I think. Because we've already got Air Cutter, which is better than Gust. Yes, you're going to learn that over Gust. Cool. And I guess let's go ahead and see if we can't make some more progression this way and catch a few more Pokemon. I'd really like to harvest from that tree, but with no Pokemon of a decent level, I don't think it's wise. I mean, I guess we could probably... Do it with Greg. Actually, Brian's up to 31. What do we think's in this tree? Probably a Burmy. A Heracross. 38. That was a crit. Um. Okay. One more. If we go strong style confusion, we knock this thing out. Hey! We actually succeeded in a battle! Without losing somebody. I shouldn't be this excited about that. But I am. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and heal up Brian. Because Brian did a good job. Um, 
use for Brian. There you go. Um, and let's also, while we're in here, because we have some more orange berries now, make some more potions. There we go. That's progress. Very, very important progress. And we'll just do a couple cartwheels over here. And we'll have Greg harvest from that red stone. What level is the Heracross? I don't know, because why would it ever tell me what level things are? Hmm. What do you think? Can I hit the Parasect? No. Of course not. Miss it by... Oh, and look at you just kind of scampering about. Stay in the ball. No. Of course not. That'd be convenient. Are you taking a nap? Look at you! You're so sweet. Nope, okay. Naptime Heracross is still too awake for me. Let's go ahead. And... They're kind of curious about me, but they don't quite know I'm here. Which I think is okay. Can I get the back strike on this guy? Turn around. Turn around. <gasps> Turn around. Or fly past me, that works too. Yeah, look at that back strike. Epic animation. Cool. Go bats up another level. Oh, we only need one more caught without being spotted for the Pokedex entries. Let's go ahead and try and do that. Oh. Turn around. You're not that- in I'm not that interesting. Seriously? Nope. Okay. That was a fail. I failed. Everybody sees me now. Okay, I'm just gonna tumble my way right into the ancient quarry, and hopefully none of them will follow me down the stairs. Okay. We have made it back to the ancient quarry, and I think this is where we will wrap up for today, hiding against this nice block of stone. But, we have caught a new Pokemon, we've made a little bit of story progression and next time we're going to try to make some more story progression so thanks you guys so much for joining me i'm napped and i'll catch you guys next time later